Today. Thank you very much. Good. What exactly brought this thought to your mind to be a president? Yes, one of it is that I don't want to pretend as if there's no problem in Nigeria. Hmm. Uh, I don't want to be a useless child of God. That's the second one. Hmm. And if there's a problem in a place, there must be a solution. I haven't discovered so many solutions for various problems in Nigeria. You know, I came out to say, okay, I want to run for that post. To fix so many problems. Hmm. To shock you, the debt Nigeria has now, I will pay it under one year. Wow. Yeah. Awesome. Now, how do you want to achieve this? I mean, a lot of people are coming, make promises to pay this debt but I want to know how do you want to achieve this within the one year time frame, frame? one of the things that we, we fail to know is we fail to realize that we are in digital world one of our mistakes is that we are operating digital world that those digital world with analog experiences mm. so you can put new wine in an old skin according to the bible mm. so we are putting old idea into the new millennial world that we are. Hmm. We are in millennial world for God's sake. You cannot operate the digital world with analog experience. So if you ask me, I will ask you that how many people do we have in Nigeria? If you can't give me the figure, you can't manage Nigeria. Hmm. So we have to work towards utilizing the potential we have in Nigeria, which is our numbers. So, I am still in shock because we all know that there's serious issues in Nigeria and you have taken it upon yourself to take the burden upon yourself. Do you think there's a future for Nigeria? Oh, thank you very much. The youths are the future of Nigeria, of which I am one of them. And the owners of the future in Nigeria are neglected, cheated, betrayed, beaten, brutalized we have so many programs that have released people that youth created hmm. they came up with banking app and this thing have really helped so many people before we go to bank too yeah. but yeah. now youth they came up with an idea app and they have it in various streets hmm. you don't need to go and queue in bank go there so that is technology yes now the future is technology enabled if we did not engage our youth if we did not carry them along if we did not give them uh, opportunity to partake in our government or give them responsibility the future is somehow we have crude oil we have gold we have cement mm -hmm. we have building we have limestone in nigeria mm -hmm. which we can engage our youth with but our youth are now no pursuing career that is lesser than their worth. My government is going to create several platforms on petroleum, giving them ideas. So we are, we are talking about building refineries for instance, and it's very, very difficult for us to just build refineries. Yes. Now, this idea of mine encouraging youth to go into petrochemical industry. Now we we'll enable them. They will. They will get to know that the money they have to make in that industry is more than the money they are making in kidnapping, in killing, in in so many in doing fraud, mm -hmm. legitimately. Mm 